We back. Use keys. <laughs> Not gonna lie, part of me feels a little... Probably just the one where you're like, well, I already played it that way. I like that way better. But I'm a little bit like, I don't know, this... It feels almost too nice. Oh, The power the, oh, key, the keys give you. Oh, yeah. You're it, like, almost, <laughs> it almost feels like the keys are being too nice to me in a game that's so cruel all the time. Okay, so I, 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 I defeated literally all of the surviving Native Americans and all of the surviving Japanese people. Uh, so next I've got to find the surviving snowman. Yeah, yeah, that's what we're doing next. Okay. Yeah. Where is Snowman? And we've we've, uh, we've we've been through a lot since then, Snowman. So watch the they, fuck They're out. gonna get fucked yeah, up, fuck bro. I'm level 26. Snowman. Ajit went from 16 to 20. Also, I don't think he was with us then. Also, look at him. I still don't know how to get past his foot. <laughs> look at you that know, man. Ajit's a scary man. He's just fucking huge. In the, in this world, you're either born as like a potato person, <laughs> or you're born as like a like a cucumber with Is it legs. The first door? Like, you're, there is an immense difference. It's the difference. fucking Virgin Chad logic taken to its most extreme version. <laughs> like, you're, you're either literally Mr. Potato Head, with, with, including the rearranging parts, or you're just, like, a fucking G.I. Joe. <laughs> exactly. And, it's, and, like, they're to scale. Yeah. <laughs> so, like, it's like the, the fucking dolls are still, like, twice as big as each other, like, from I know, different he, companies. He is by far much bigger than the rest of us, especially yeah. our fish. So, <laughs> you could also be born a fish person, apparently. Yeah, that's pretty bad. That's a pretty bad time. Don't be born a fish. I mean, you don't know. He, Pro could, he tip, could be living a If you're born a, a fish, life. go back in time. Don't be a fish. I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk into my room and say that's yeah. all my fish in my aquariums. Be like, fuck yeah. you. Y'all, you all lost. <laughs> you fucked up. I'm on this side of yeah. the glass. <laughs> Taunt the fish. They don't even know. Like, yeah. <laughs> although actually, some of them have really good eyesight. They can, they, they can see you when you're like oh, doing stuff in your room. the wrong way. Which is a little bit weird when you think of it that way. Go the wrong way. Fixable. <laughs> I need a long rope, but the other one is upstairs. I think it was the one all the way up here. I think this was the snowman. Dr. McSnowman. <laughs> Dr. McSnowman, you just, you upped him. Yep. He has a PhD now. Yeah. <laughs> we just thought that guy dug a hole for us. <laughs> it was cool. It was cool. I was excited. I was, I wish, I wish that that was cave. real. <laughs> oh well. See, you know how you're like, oh, I kind of liked it better when the game was harder. I kind of liked it better when I thought that guy dug a tunnel for yeah, us. Yeah, no, that was like, that was one of those ones <laughs> I'll go back to that game. It's sad when you imagine something really cool and then it doesn't happen. Like, there was a, there's a, a fucking incredible bit that happened in Monster Prom where we were, we were, we, they were like, you're not, you're not a fucking werewolf. And then like, the character convinced the, the, were, the wolf pack, like, well, it's not a full moon right now, isn't, isn't it? Like, nobody's a werewolf. No one's a wolf right now. That doesn't mean they're not a werewolf. You're not a wolf right now, right? So it's like, dude, you've been a wolf this whole, you've been a werewolf this whole time. You didn't even tell us. It's so humble. And so, and then, <laughs> but, but then they're like taking it to its extreme. They're like, wait. It's like it's like Vera's not a wolf right now either. She could be a werewolf. Like everything that's not currently a wolf, it could be a werewolf. That tree, that tree could be a werewolf. And I'm like, oh, the tree. Scott play. Scott plays the tree in the play, so it's gonna actually be a werewolf. It wasn't. I'm like, no. <laughs> that was incredible. That's that would have been incredible. That would have been a great setup. Because because the the one werewolf main werewolf character actually does play a tree. It'd be incredible if that was just actually Scott, and that's the joke. But no. Well, you know, maybe you should write. You should Damn. write that game. Damn. Send them a letter saying I'm that. I'm coming for your jobs. <laughs> Dude, I mean, you, you know, gotta go back in time and patch that quest to be better. <laughs> I could be a werewolf. I could be a werewolf. <laughs> Y'all don't no notice when I. You know, guys don't notice the days where I'm just in my room. It's the it's full moon yeah. days. Loudly listening to video essays and playing Animal Crossing <laughs> as a wolf. <laughs> that, is, that is exactly what I do. It's the Mr. Flattop Man again. This time, I will murder everyone he's ever cared about. <laughs> I'll be dipped. And I, I won't like, even need arms. I do like. I'll be dipped. I want to use. I'll that. be dipped. I'll be dipped. Damn it. I'll be dipped and call me Susan. <laughs> <laughs> Don't call me Shirley. <laughs> Don't call me ever. <laughs> Another floatman. 
Is he floating or is he crab I, I thought he was crab, crab. I think he's crab shuffling back there. Not as cool. No, not nearly as cool. What a loser. Looks like these guys are all holding hands, which I do like. <laughs> like hands across America. Oh no. <laughs> the rocket impaler is not likely to miss. It is very expensive. Restraining order on the scary man. You get special attention. Fuck you. Wow. We just deleted that man. He just got wrestled to hell. <laughs> That's crazier than that call in 82. <laughs> <laughs> Forgot what the fuck you're talking about. No, Brad is prone. Don't be prone. Be uh, oh, successful in your endeavors. <laughs> They're just like group wrestling these guys right now. I think if, if you if you played sports in high school and you didn't become a professional uh, player and you're still talking about it as an adult, like w I mean, obviously there's a difference between like reminiscing as opposed to like making it your identity. Yeah. I think there, there's a problem with this. High high school, which ended tw ten years ago, is my personality. I was thinking about that. There's an episode of King of the Hill where. Uh, uh, Bill. Bill was a football player in high school, but it's like the only thing he has because Bill's like, is, Bill's kind of a wash up and they decided to like revoke his title or they give it to someone else. Like somebody else is going to break his record. And so they try to prevent it because it's like the only thing that Bill has is like this record he had in high school. Dude, that got scary. Good. We needed, <laughs> we needed to get scary. We like scary. hit the level threshold where certain characters got some bullshit. <laughs> Start getting momentum, and then the game's gonna knock your ass back down again. It's gonna take your legs next. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> he's gen he genuinely just has to roll around. It's still, still, and he still just keeps continuing his quest. At some point, it just becomes empowering. Like holy shit, he's just he's just still going. Yeah. No, honestly, go. I would have a lot of respect for that. <laughs> That fish has a gun! I already have respect for those people now who do like the triathlons with no legs, and I'm like, everyone else is, I was like, what is the rest, what is my excuse for not being good? Yeah. I've doing it, I've impaled too much. I've run out of impale. So dedicated to my craft. When you throw yeah. yourself at him, good thing you don't land on his spiky shoulders, because that would just fucking... Yeah. That would impale you. Unless you got that acid blood. Those are the people you watch out for when you're in the mosh pit. <laughs> the ones that have acid blood? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, th that too. <laughs> <laughs> Those are the people you watch out for in the mosh pit. <laughs> I think maybe, maybe all the time. Yeah, just, just general advice. That person's an alien. <laughs> <laughs> so fucking stupid. You don't give paper cuts to that person, Keith. Where's my boy? <laughs> Where's, my, Where's boy? my boy? He's so sad, he's gonna die alone. Fireball. Maybe we should have killed him first so you didn't have to watch all of his boys. <laughs> no, this is this is the actual this is the point. This is this is This, this is why is we punishment. did this. Yeah. This is all on purpose. Also still restraining order. Please don't hit me. Frankly, dude, you Please didn't have to me. you didn't have to fight us at all. Like yeah. what were you thinking? No, I failed at restraining orders. Get it together! Pick up the defense! No, you don't got people. You to you talk yeah, I was gonna say, you're talking to, bud. These must be like health threshold comments. <laughs> Well, that's useful. None of the other people have these. The snowmen lose their snow heads, though. That's helpful, I guess. <laughs> Harvey's strong. He can he can put paralysis on somebody, and he, they might bleed at the same time. Da, son of a bitch! That's it. Is he gonna transform? Oh no! <laughs> okay, okay. Oh. What the hell was that? You boys are on a constant fuck streak. <laughs> How can we play ball if we can't even rustle down this guy? Sorry, buff. Sorry, my ass, softy. You're all cut. You, bald guy. Your teamwork is on point. Are we getting him? Blind your colors from now on. Oh, and by the way, I'm taking my damn toolbox with me. 
Yay. We probably need that. But yeah, I guess that's what I was saying. It's one hey, of somebody didn't need. die for once. They became our friend. Buffalo Van Dyke. I love it. American guy. Achievement unlocked American guy. Yeah. Status? He was American guy. Level 20 oh, Buffalo. Yeah. All right. Are you, are you, well, are you put the spike pads on him. Yeah, Take a former knees, football baby. player. He played Take so rough that he night. lost his eye on the field, probably because of the spikes on his shoulders. Yeah, don't wear spikes when you're playing football with each other. Yeah, that's Fuck the ups. opposite of what the gear is for. And this, is, this is some fucking blood bowl shit. I'm gonna miss fixing up old cars and tossing a pig skin around. Oh, he misses his daddy. <laughs> I have a spider dad for you. <laughs> the Olathe Stampedes died today. Oh, that was their team name. Yeah. Don't cry, Red. Don't cry. Let's get through this. <laughs> you are unworthy. Yeah, we kicked you guys' ass. Yep. Frankly. Get dunked on, even though it's the wrong sport. There's a little hand. Oh, uh oh, I don't feel good about that. <laughs> oh no, it just was a dead person. Don't mind it. It's probably just what does that one say? It's probably just a Does it say something? Snooman. I couldn't click on it. The hand. Oh no, it just there, it looked like there was writing in the snow. The one the thing I just passed the, yeah. a second ago after you said it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like on that either. Oh no, I think it's just. It's oh, just it's like, a face. It is okay. I was. Yeah. Just, I thought it that. said. That's a face. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. That's a hand. You know, it's, I think it's just melted Snoomans. May have never oh. been people. Ah! Ah! What? <laughs> <laughs> wow! What the fuck? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it was so bad. That's <laughs> no. Sure, you're not afraid of spiders. Uh, that's, not a, that's not a spider. I like spiders. I don't like that. <laughs> Peter. Are you sure he's not a spider? Yes. <laughs> this is your that he might be a spider. <laughs> he's got the branding. He has, really, he has to have eight legs. I should have gotten back and resurrected. Well, we didn't know this was gonna happen. I mean, we're moving forward. There's more level. That's always a bad sign. I love that I can these pokes. They don't cost anything, and they all have status effects. But that doesn't mean he doesn't have an attack. He just has pokes. I would like to put a restraining order on that. Yeah, let's do don't that. Don't fucking look at me. <laughs> I would put a restraining order on that for Come sure. On. Stay away from my children and also all of people. Oh. Wow. Oh. Oh. He's dead. Oh. He's not KO'd. He's dead. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he just fucking died. Oh. You can just lose a character in the middle of a fight forever. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Kill me. <laughs> Oh, that was... oh. He's just dead! He's actually dead now! I... <laughs> he was an American girl. Oh, yeah! Raised on All right! Take it easy, Peter! <laughs> don't kill our... Don't kill our guys! What the... That came out oh of my nowhere! God. I liked I oh I liked oh no, no. Artie oh, what the fuck Keith what are we gonna do I'm gonna have to replay that whole boss fight at this rate because I, I don't think I'm surviving to? this fight but I also don't know what to do oh god man I made a mistake of not saving immediately okay he's just KO'd what he doesn't like fish <laughs> cool I'm not I mean I'm not winning this fight. I'm gonna Wait, have but, to... but Harvey's not gone. Yeah, no, he just he just killed us. It's, uh, he just defeated us instead of killing us. But it's a game over, so I have to redo the whole fight. But what the fuck are we supposed to do? We can't add. All right. All right. Take it easy, right. baby. Make it last night. Make it last all night. night. <laughs> she was an American. American. She was Peter was something. Fuck. It's just why. 
always always leave and save every time you accomplish literally anything because yeah. this game will fuck you <laughs> holy shit this wasn't a very hard fight though it wasn't especially not the thing especially after what had followed it stop don't shove your hand in there don't shove your hand in there don't shove don't shove your don't shove, shove your, your hand, hand in there, there. <laughs> nobody likes that guy please fucking in stop him this is a preview for our parody album. I'm used to writing parodies because I sing them to my dog. I incorporate her <laughs> in, in, on, in music all the time. Oh man, everybody's falling for me. Because <laughs> you're so beautiful. Wait, did I follow everybody so consistently? Pretty much. I actually don't really have a reason to use fall this turn. Everybody's already fallen. Ow. My characters are like they're falling from the fucking sky. Hame, hame, fuck you. <laughs> Made a jeet fall. Ooh. How dare they? It takes a long time for him to fall. He's very tall. He's like a tree. Ah, oh, he's still missing his turn. Was it was that where was that was that cliff where the scary Peter was? With what? That, that that cliff where the scary Peter was. That wasn't where. Uh, no no no. I continued forward after defeating him. We, we have to go back to Tardy. Yeah. I think that we have. We have everything we need. I think we just. I needed, don't know. No, I think we just needed. But either way, I need to go back and save just to. Yeah, we're not going not that way. Go through this shit we're again. not going that way again, Keith. Yeah, killed two characters. I feel like. We're not going that way until we go everywhere else to find out that we haven't found everything yet. <laughs> then we have to go back. Maybe, maybe that's... Maybe you're not supposed to go that way? Because maybe you're using the boat to go to the right because of that guy? Or maybe we'll find something later that is his Peter, the Peter weakness. <laughs> the Peter weakness? I guess all those- The all Peter those, Defeater. The Peter Defeater! We're gonna find an item that's literally called- The Peter Defeater <laughs> the Peter defeats defeater. Peter. It's it's a, it's a repeater. <laughs> the, 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 the Peter Defeater repeater. <laughs> Dude, if that actually happens. That's like the entire reason to make a video game is to just fill it full of stupid, stupid shit. Keith, why haven't you made a video game yet? Dog residue. You have so much stupid shit. Fucking dog residue. <laughs> was incredible. <laughs> I've never emotionally recovered from dog residue. <laughs> I mean, who could? <laughs> yeah. Come on, Buffalo Van Dyke. <laughs> I'm like, bro, they're already dead. <laughs> I've killed everyone you cared about. But see, we, we just defeated them. We didn't kill them like me yeah. and Peter, dude. You know, Peter. I guess that explained all those bodies for walking up the snowy mountain. Yeah. Yeah, I guess they were more real bodies than I thought they were. <laughs> I definitely did not think they were real bodies at all. What's funny is you got snowmen. I'm like, but they didn't have arms, though. <laughs> I just yeah. remember thinking that in my brain. They're like, well-made snowmen that have arms. <laughs> Duh. All right, we got buffalo. We're, we're dipping, because... Yep. We're dicking. Dicking? <laughs> Not that. The Buffalo Van Dick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to do optimize. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. As if dialogue matters. Do it anyway. It's Ooh, good. Hoo, hoo, buff. The dumbest thing is that I think there was a save point right here. Silly I just thought I'd go past them and go see whatever's over there. Wait, like, it's what usually, it's usually you there? can go scope it and out. And the game was like, <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha You've made it. What a terrible night to have a curse. <laughs> Just once I want to hear a horse sound instead of a truck, <laughs> and it's never explained. <laughs> like, hang on a minute. You actually rode a horse here. The goofiness, Ding. the goofiness that is, is like ultra rare surprise things in games. See if you're paying attention. 
like the uh was i think battlefield has the comedy uh reload animations where when you every like 100,000th time you reload or something rips or like that it, it'll do something completely unreasonable i love just that to fuck with you i like to like pt had a bunch of stuff like that PT, PT had a bunch of stuff forever. that only happened like one in a thousand times. So like a bunch of people had a bunch of different experiences because yeah. like, oh, there's like a bunch of stuff like that. The game that I wanted that never will exist. Good <laughs> sail. Oh, oh, a way to propel. Tardy, cool. use your fucking together. legs. <laughs> so we're missing a propeller. <clears throat> or, or a guy with big legs. Yeah, like spot like Peter. Buffalo, Buffalo Van. Peter Dick. Van Spider. Oh. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> <clears throat> he would make a good propeller, though. We definitely have three of those things. We have a sail, we have tools, and we have, have wood. The wood. So what... Okay, let's, see, let's think about what... Harvey, I think it's time for you to go. Sorry, Harvey. I've got Van Dyke. Sportsman. He's and smelly. He... He's smelly. Good. I've got two smellies in my party. <laughs> good. I'm collecting smelly bellies. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. I don't like that. <laughs> Uh, where the fuck am I? Uh, I don't remember this one. Imagine, like, in real life having a person that. Oh, we have to go to the motorcycle place, yeah, but I don't know how a, to go. Yeah, I think we need a motorcycle. There. I'm gonna check this place to remember whether or not I didn't finish something. That weird guy just crouching over a barrel. Yeah, I think he attacked <laughs> me. That guy attacked me, I think. Oh, it's so happy. It makes me feel better. Maybe this is another place where someone kicked my ass. Find out. Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm trying to remember, like... I don't remember an item. Like, we just got all three items back to back. So I don't remember any of them coming from here. Maybe I gave up on this one, too. Very possible. Famous for giving up. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good! <laughs> Level three. Kill me! Whee! <laughs> I hate it. I feel like we can, we can counter that person. We took the soup. It's empty. Yeah, that's how you knew you were here, because the soup's fucking gone. <laughs> oh, that's the girder that had to respawn on my way back. Yeah. Because there was no way to get back. I had to, like, catapult a bunch of people to get across, and mm -hmm. then the magic girder just spawned when I was leaving. Was, that's a lore break. How dare you. This nice little little trumpet solo. <laughs> Mom says I get to have a solo. <laughs> There's something really pleasant about this song. No, I'm really digging it. Even though it sounds like it's played on automatons. That's fine. <laughs> There's no problem with that. Automatons with vibrato. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, I, def oh. I definitely got my ass kicked here, didn't I? Yeah, I think so. Are you ready for beauty? <laughs> You're not. But too bad, too bad. Because here it is, baby. Yay! Woo! Woo! Wow! <laughs> this guy! <laughs> he just slides at us. I remember this guy. Ding! <laughs> so beautiful. Well, we really went to every single boss before we defeated any of them. We, we, we needed to practice. Boss? <laughs> Shh! Just let it soak in. So <laughs> soak it in! <laughs> I knew it. I, sir, I have no arms. Okay. Listen up, Grandpa. See this face? It's the gosh damn apocalypse, baby. And my face is still smoother than your bald head. I am perfection. Amen? You suck, you ugly suck. <laughs> no. no. Yes. Yes, you are. are. Be nice. Yes, you him. Don't give me that cheap, cheap trash. Uh, do I need your approval? Well, you just asked for no it. No diddly. Oh. You just asked for it, you punk. You've stepped under the ladder, old man. <laughs> wow. What a fucking threat. You've stepped under the ladder, old man. Because your luck has run out. <laughs> because your luck has run out. Out, baby. I, I like that phrase. <laughs> You've stepped under the so, ladder, okay. old man. Okay, so. He's got a teepee. I'll be dipped. I'll be dipped. I'll be dipped and you and stepped, you under, stepped the under the ladder, ladder old man. man. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. You're about to get yucked. He's yeah, not, not going to like that on his pretty face. He's not going to like it at all. 
He's not gonna like football maneuver. All the American smelly tornado. Voice. Okay. Savage Rush, channel the spirit of the buffalo. I could use more concrete terms. <laughs> yeah, can you mean. please define these? Boulder screw, a momentum based body screw. Okay. That seems like that would hurt Ta you just to tackling. do. But then yeah, he, no. he does have the boulder screw. I just imagine someone like him like break, hurting his back doing that. <laughs> slap 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 kiss. <laughs> <laughs> Ding. Plunk. Please be prone. No. 1700 damage. Wow. That's just from my status effects. From being yucked and uh, burned. Hawk Hollywood. Are you ready to meet the savage elbow? I don't know how I feel about Artie just having a bag full of random stuff he throws at people. <laughs> <laughs> and he always does more. He attacks like 4th of July fireworks. <laughs> Everyone had, just they rushed had, like, at him. They had like reverb. I don't know if he can be knocked over. Too powerful. He's too handsome. You can't knock over handsome people, don't you know? <laughs> it's, it's it's the secret power. Yeah. It's the center of gravity is just a black hole. Black hole's their personality. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Uh, yeah, you, not, you can't trust people that are not, too pretty. He's not falling over. Still poisoned, but I need to reapply fire. <laughs> Oh, I forgot to reapply the fire. <laughs> Silly me. Ah, oh, you blinded my fireman. Ding! I, I, I love his, good enough. I love that. Wow. Wow. Please die of everything that I'm doing to you. I mean, I don't really want. I like him. I don't really want. To die. I hope he joins we'll our lose, team too. At least he won't though. <clears throat> Tackle. Him being TP oh. is weird. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I can get TP. I like. I think I lost them. We got to generate TP. I guess he just gets a little bit from just hitting people. Wait, Buffalo? Yeah. The rocket Impaler. What is what is what is TP for set? Like he generated over time. Oh. It looks like he generated from getting hit or or hitting people. But what is it? Like as opposed to the SP. Tactical points, maybe. Maybe. I think it's the equivalent. Yeah, I, get you, I guess you haven't seen that stuff, but like, there's you, obviously there's mana in games. Yeah. And then in a, a lot of MMOs, there's often like a rage mechanic. There's like a rage meter. Yeah, well, which is thing yeah. That it builds up when you're hitting instead of having a mana meter. Hard times, Daddy. Hard times. No, join our team. Uh, I love you. <laughs> USA flag. <laughs> you're not supposed to wear that as clothing. It's like the rules. I don't, I don't care. <laughs> it's a free country. Oh, the flag is the sail. The fan is how we're going to move. Oh, oh. That's what's going on. Gotcha. Still alive, technically. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. He didn't explode. He just got very bloody. Who the fuck are these, these guys? Just... Welp. Yep. Yep. I love that there's always one guy that just has dots for eyes just hanging out. Okay. We follow Hawk, but we don't like him. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Psst. Good job. It's really fucking annoying. He's still over there. Is he still behind me? I better not shit talk then. But I said that out loud. You're not supposed to see me like this. Is Join he... me. Like his fingers <laughs> bent backwards. That's not good. What that? A mint condition cloth. Or that's the sale. I don't fucking know <laughs> I guess, anymore. I, I guess that's the sale, and the American flag is just clothes. Who likes to wear America? Pro you? Probably Buffalo. Not you. USA flag. America, Buffalo. Buffalo, 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 Buffalo. He wears a dandy hat with a bloody lab coat. Like, what is his aesthetic? Wait, who? That's, uh, that's RT. Wearing a bloody lab coat and a dandy hat. <laughs> well... He's how he, he's slasher chic. Yeah, I was gonna say with the duffel bag, the, the lab coat kind of works. I don't know about the dandy hat though. With the lab coat, you just look like a flasher, and you have like the bag with you. You just look like a bad. You look like a guy you tell your kids to stay away from. 
Oh wait, not not automatons. What this sounds like is those little toys you squeeze and they sing. Hi oh Yeah, it's not automaton. No, there's a there's little toys that you squeeze and their face opens up and they and they do a little screaming of the note and you get a bunch of the ones that play different notes. They showed up on Vlogbrothers a lot. I don't remember why. But they got it they got into them enough oh. that like custom ones started happening. Oh, I know what you're talking about. I liked None of these weapons literally this entire part of the list, none of those weapons can be used by a single party member. That's how fucking weird our party could be at this point. <laughs> those are all characters we don't have. We can just it really, it really makes you wonder how, like, I mean, well, obviously must be yeah. missing a lot of people. It's just queen bands, which I can't afford, but uh, I, pro I can probably afford them if I sell something. I mean, are they really that good? Uh, some people got numbers up. I can sell these, all these old pants. Oh! You sold the good ones. No, I got rid of the American flag replaced those already. Oh, okay. Like, holy shit, they, they cost like you, 300. You still they, have that nipple. It's not good. Yeah, it's not great. No, I wish we didn't carry that around with no. us. Maybe, maybe we can still save it. Oh, no. <laughs> maybe we can save it. Yeah, no, it gives uh, Ajit 15 and Buffalo 37. Oh, wow. Yeah. Let's get a couple of those. Oop, nope, a couple of those. And sell whatever I get replaced. God, it's their weapons too. They're both punchy boys, <laughs> so we're like, we're really we're we're really double dipping on weapon types. What really like? What are, what are the queen bands? They're just like bangles. Yeah, I think they're just wrist bands. By Jill. Yeah, these are studded bands. So you just you wear you wear like like armor like like spiky bracelets and stuff on your punchy boys, and that somehow makes them punch gooder. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's the science. Science. It's like painting stripes on your car. Yeah, it makes it go faster. Yeah. It's, it's like when you paint oh, the angry faces on your flames airplanes. Flames are S tier, bruh. <laughs> yeah. You definitely won't get pulled over if you have flames on your car. I think we ironically beat this chapter faster than any of the other ones if, if we are as done as it feels like we are. Despite the, the mess things were. He... To, to the relief of the audience. <laughs> <laughs> to like, fucking thank god. Oh, I should have. <clears throat> Heal me. And save. Save me. Save me. The game really teaches you to fear this mechanic. Yeah, we got punished like almost instantly. Yeah, for it. but it, but I guess it was because we were always making progress. But once you've like tripped the bad thing that happens at one of them, it seems to just then be safe. <laughs> like, I, like, like that's it. <laughs> well, no, I think like, I, I do. I, I do Oops. feel like it's like a dice roll or something, and I think it just we, we really really maybe because we beat this area. <laughs> maybe it, it feels like truck keys are overpowered. Basically, I think maybe we just got a bad a bad roll really early and made us really scared of everything. Um. Oh. Oh wait, is that who I think it is? Isn't that our friend? Is he oh, dead yet? um, Sicky. Didn't I imagine him as a giant boss fight in a, yeah. In a dream? Yeah. Was it you? <laughs> Sorry, old friend. I can't let you destroy the world. Step aside. Oh, it's Step you. aside, Sticky. No. Oh. Sad motion sounds. Wait, 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 wait a minute. I'm, I'm gonna head slide him. <laughs> Wait, no. He wasn't the one that we had the option to kill, right? Uh, it was the other guy, I think. I don't, the guy I spike batted? That was the, the... Yeah, that was the third friend that was not the one that died at the beginning. The guy with the most complicated face. Yeah. I don't know how else to describe him. A boulder screw. I don't know which why, why I would pick any of my moves over the other ones as Buffalo. Because they're, oh, they're really vaguely explained. Well, I mean, that's, that's the learning. Learning. Oh my god, he's got a gun! Whoa, that's a lot of gunning he's doing. You, you can stop. A lot, of, a lot of TP, though. Stop, please. I don't like this. This music makes me feel like it's not good. Uh, <laughs> let's try to st do anything I can to make him stop shooting me at this point. Well, if you gouge out his eye, he only has one. Man, that machine gun really gave me a lot of uh, TP. It took so much damage. 
Well, okay, at least he's hitting different people. Well, he's missing because he blinded him. Yay. Did it work? Yeah. He got blinded. Oh, he changed his targets. Which is kind of good, in a way. Oh yeah, it's a really low damage attack, so if he's spreading it out constantly... Well, when he hit Buffalo the first time, it was it was in the hundreds. It wasn't it wasn't 47, it was like yeah. one something. He also like only hit him, which is like, stop. <laughs> he's weirded and blinded and burned. He's him weirded. And poisoned. Let's make him wary. Just add to the problems that he's got. <laughs> Yeah, are you sure you want to attack your friend, buddy? Is it worth it, buddy? Bud? Pal? You shooting a guy with no arms, that's pretty fucked up right now. It's not a good look for him. <laughs> He's doing it very purposefully. <laughs> the best time to delete this gunfire was before you did it. The second time is right now. <laughs> <laughs> I feel sad about Sticky. It's hard to feel that sad. He's shooting me with a gun. <laughs> and the gun's bigger than him. Yes! Please stop gunning me. God, that's a lot of damage. Ah, my party. Jeez, I feel like I'm supposed to feel weak right about now. Don't do this. Hmm. Ajit just goes, hmm. That's all he's got to say about it. Meaningless minutes. trash. Oh, sticky. Yeah, he's gone. I mean, I do feel bad only because I... It's a tough situation, I get his point. <laughs> Just yep. saying. Gotta do the smart thing. <laughs> that is smart. Uh, I'm a little tired of it already. <laughs> of being See, doing the smart thing. It's a it's a blessing and a curse. <laughs> it not, takes literally seconds to do. And it helps you out a lot, but now you're obligated to do it all the time. <laughs> yeah. You're basically cheating. I'm not watching anymore. <laughs> If we were cheating, we would have, like, reset the Russian Oops. roulette section and not killed all of our friends. Oh, yeah, it just saves come every single thing. Yeah. With the power of editing, you can undo, like, anything and still make it look like it was what happened the first time. He's admitting. Yeah. <laughs> it's a, you, I've, I've been up to some shit before. <laughs> Whee. Especially a game like this, look how static it is. Oh, you could match frames so easily and no one would know. <laughs> You know, it's funny, if, if, if Siki really wanted to stop us, he should have just killed Tardy. Yeah. Because Tardy was the way, he was going to make the boat. Yeah, but he's so moral that he had to fight me specifically. But he had, he had, thing, he had... He's not that one guy that keeps getting nipples off. Good. That, good. <laughs> oh. You got all the supplies to make a boat? That's great. Let's get to the building. Let's get to building this sucker. Are you all ready to go? I know the girl is over there on that island. Make sure you've got everything you need. That's scary. Let's go. I'm ready. I bet I can't do the uh, thing anymore. What thing? Uh, the keys. Yeah, probably. It sounds like a point of no return. Or maybe just an extended segment where I can't get out for a bit. Okay. Let's, well, build, let's build the boat and go. Oh, that's you. My group needs some rest. No, they don't. I'll build the boat with you. Oh, okay. With my no arms. Let them sleep. They'll need it. Really? You got no arms, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're all right. Whatever you say, boss. Brad and Tardy worked long into the night while your party rested. I don't like that this is being framed. I don't like the framing of us being separated from our party. Yeah, like, why are they pointing this out? They barely spoke with each other. Because Brad's hammer was in his mouth. All right, this looks good to me. Well, are they talking about your party? Keep your voice down. Maybe. <laughs> Why? We should go wake your guys and get- uh oh. No. Just me and you. What? Why? Tardy. Let's go. Brad! I like- I- I- No! I, I said uh oh right in the middle of me reading the dialogue because I yeah. read it with my eyes and I was like, oh, he's leaving yeah. them. <laughs> oh no. You abandoned your party and set sail with Tardy for the island. Abandon the party, get on with Tardy. I just spent all my money on gearing them up. What? I would have spent it on consumables. You shit. I just spent like 250 gil or whatever the fuck the money mags. Yeah. For sh uh, wristbands that I never got to use a single time. That is bullshit. <laughs> what? I would have bought like a hundred, I guess, healing items. Perfume's useless now. I can't revive myself. This is a rock. I do really. How did that happen? I do really like this. This is really goofy. <laughs> Oh, 
I'd almost be concerned that it might be like there's there maybe a physics thing going on here where this wouldn't work. Because the force of you pushing with the fan might push the boat in the opposite direction with equal force to the wind going into the fan, into the sail. I don't know. Well, I mean, fans are built in a way to only propel. Like, if you use it right, it doesn't push air back at you as much as it pushes forward. No, I, I mean, the force of swinging the fan might push force through your feet into the boat in the opposite direction. Oh. And not all the air will necessarily convert directly to the sail, so you might even be putting more force backwards and forward. I mean, you might, you might but be able. But this is some fucking shitty you... napkin physics by somebody that took that took it in college a decade ago. So I don't. Yeah, know. I was gonna say. I, I think I think you can build a really efficient fan to not yeah. move to not like cause like basically to cause. Because there's probably not be something to be said about how swinging a fan is itself <laughs> like a relatively minor amount of force to make a huge amount of like gust kind of because of how they're designed well i think about all the all the ancient royalty that that made their people they, they yeah. basically like got into the habit of building really efficient fans because yeah. that was like their only form of air conditioning at a certain point but at the same time also i don't think anyone ever like made a giant hair dryer to point at their sail to propel their boat in the hill of history <laughs> so there might be a reason why it doesn't work well there are those giant fans you put on the back of the boats that are fundamentally the same thing when are there fans that you point at a sail in a sailboat no to make no, it go no they cut out the sail entirely they make it more efficient by just using the fan and yeah pushing it on yeah the in boat. the other direction yes yeah. i think i think there's no point in having the sail if you already have the fan yeah there's, there's got to be a reason why it's never happened before, <laughs> is that, which is that's probably that someone actually did try it, because every it, stupid idea has probably been tried. Probably is how we got here. Okay, well, she's on the island somewhere. Let's go find her. I'm ready for some action. No. What do you mean, no? That's not going to happen. Huh? Hey, fella. I didn't just go through all that work for a pat on the back. I want a piece of that little bitch. Oh fuck, Tardy, no! no! Tardy, no! I saved your brother. Oh no, Tardy, no. And now I'm gonna kill you. Oh, my heart's broken. No, it's not, no, it's it's not Farty. I know, but still I like Tardy too. Yeah, but we're not emotionally attached to Tardy in I the know, same way. I know, but he, I oh. thought he was our friend. Kamehame, fuck you. I didn't think he was a gross person. Oh, he's, he's poop. All right, I'm just gonna keep biting him then. <laughs> he can't hurt me. Oh, he's... I think he said Shardy, Farty. Oh. Said the name of his family as they died. He was trash. Was the implication that Shardy's dead because of that boat we saw? Maybe. What happened to Shardy? He's dead. Good. I don't remember if we met... Oh, more bottles. I don't know if we met Shardy or if we just had a reference to the idea of Shardy. No, we met... We got on the boat with Shardy. Was he the first boat guy? Yeah. They all look the same, remember? Yeah, but I don't remember all the people individually. Oh, we forgot about Toby! Still have, yeah, but I don't know where to take him. Oh, Toby told us, but I forgot. He said the beach. Well, that's <laughs> useful, thanks. And like, what? <clears throat> I don't know what that means. So we're just carrying around this person in our pocket. <laughs> the tag reads Mike. <laughs> well. So they took my bike. That was rude. They oh. took my bikes and they took my, my keys. It makes me items. think that this is might be like a point. I think it's the ending. Yeah. You don't even get to keep your friends. <laughs> you just picking all these Oop. up with your mouth. <laughs> Where is he? How does he store them? Swallows them like a snake. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Uh. Oh, fuck! Didn't I? What was he? Who? I forgot who this man was. It's it's dad, isn't it? Is that? Oh, that does look like. Is that yeah. Dad? Yeah. Oh man. Fuck. Uh. Child, what are those little blue things? It's called joy. Where'd you get that? Someone gave them to me. They don't taste good, but they make you feel good. Oh no. <laughs> oh, no. Sweetheart, I don't think you should take those. What? What are you looking at? Who's there? What are you... You... I can't believe you're still alive. Is he blind? Bradley... Kill Marty! Ooh. No! Brad, stop! Don't hurt him, he saved my life! Move. <clears throat> 
Move. Oh, damn. Hey, don't you hit her. Brad versus dickhead. Marty Armstrong. Failed. Is he... Can he hurt me? How did... How did they find each other? Marty Armstrong doesn't want to do this. No. <laughs> oh, nope. <laughs> I gotta be worried. Oh, I'm crying. Nobody makes me cry my own tears. Oh! Wow. Stop. Don't oh. hurt him. Uh. Oh, man. Escape? Nope. Oh, no. Uh, oh, my perfume is useless now. I'm gonna jerky. Let's see what happens. Buddy is crying. Oh. Buddy's defending herself not very well. I'm just a little girl. <laughs> Stop. <clears throat> Brad is oiled up. What a description. Do I have to do I have to attack? I don't know. Is this a trick? Is this a um tutorial? <laughs> this is a tutorial situation. I believe her name was Tutorial. I can't believe I didn't like catch it till so late. <laughs> this is not great news. I'm going to bite her. No. Oh man. This is not good news. I'm using my weakest attack. Please leave. Did we fuck up by attacking? Attacking him, yeah. Probably. So but mad. But he's crying deeply. Oh, they're just gonna make this keep happening, huh? Can't escape or leave or stop. Well. Guess who's loading a save? <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> Why are you doing this? Because the game's making me. It's mean. Now father's crying. Yeah, because you... You, so you call him father now. Instead yeah, of... it changed. Yeah. Father is out. Hero experience. They didn't say dead. Good, you don't deserve experience for that. Bradley. I've changed. Lisa. Baby. So he thinks she's Lisa. I'm sorry. Or, or you could be talking to someone who's not here. Yeah. Is that the ending? Save? Oh, fuck. No. No, 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 let's not. <laughs> <clears throat> That's not. I'd rather not, actually. Buddy. Damn it. He took the boat. She took the boat. Now am I just trapped with my dad? Oh, he didn't survive. At all. Nothing, Nothing remains. remains. The, the joy, joy is gone. gone. In more way than one. It's just a smear. And I'm just alone on an island with no arms and no food. I mean, you have to eat farty. Or tardy. Use tardy, tardy as, as a as boat! A boat. <laughs> Uh, uh, oh my gosh. <laughs> I mean, that is what you would do. <laughs> this, is fucking, 
This this kettle drum music is not suit the mood. <laughs> making you wallow in this. Oh, man. We're literally like, we're, we're floating on a corpse, armless, into the sea. Yeah, we don't really got a lot going for us, do we? No. The person we're trying to save hates us. We're not even... And the fucking, we... sa the fucking soundtrack's just fucking like, and I don't know where I want to go when the volcano blows. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, I don't know. Well, is it here where the, the skull is? Is this where you want to go when the volcano blows? That can't be good. Nope. Can you even get up a ledge? Oh yeah, you can. You can jump. We are the skull club. We like skulls. Can't you tell? <laughs> skulls. Achievement at the end, isn't I? Throw me into the barbed wire. So anyway. Everybody fucking die. Do 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 Remember party members? Remember all that money you spent on your party? You just sell all their stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they already have the queen band. That sucks. Problem with that idea is I don't feel like a... <laughs> what is the... Uh... How much money do I have right now? At least spend that. Uh, yeah, this button, that button, here, there. All right. Bandar, there you are. What do you mean? That's just a cabinet. <laughs> There's not a guy in there. It's oh my precedent. gosh! <laughs> Holy shit! I can answer. I afforded fifteen. Full health jerkays. That's a lot of jerkay. That's Betar. As much as it would hurt to like jump off a ledge that high, I mean, the thought of me, thought of the you landing on a bike from that high just makes, <laughs> that sounds like that would really fucking hurt. It seems like people can get away with that. But yeah, I'm always really, yeah, but there's like a way to, I don't think you just fall like. Point blank, I think get to be like get to be like yeah. You know, I just I've seen people like jump off buildings on bikes and stuff, and they can weirdly it's like they can, it's like the bike allows them to like shock like impact uh, uh, <clears throat> absorb like, the shock of the impact. Yeah, yeah. I mean, all those BMX folks have like a way they poise their body in a way, and they have the right bikes, and they have, like they have shocks on their bikes too. I just don't think they're, they're like falling from like a straight cliff straight down on on their bike. R.I.P. that ship. Yeah, like I said, where I forgot about what happened. So I guess that's probably yeah. I guess that must be our boat from before, which is the one that she stole. So something happened to it somehow, and then she got saved by Dad. Whomst we have complex feelings with. Yeah. Which seems understandable. Yeah, I think oh. I remember him being pretty awful before, and then I think there's also a whole other game of context. And I think there's a lot of implied context, you know. It just like, got really dynamic. Yeah. It wasn't this dynamic before. I don't remember this. Old dramatic. Now you gotta, gotta, gotta kill. You little shit. Chomp. <laughs> You're not even worth using attacks on. All you can do is get me oily and stunned. <laughs> bite being a primary attack is terrifying at this point. <laughs> what I do? I bite people? <laughs> Big fan? <laughs> I mean, you know, worked for uh, Mike Tyson. <laughs> and Ozzy Osbourne. Well, he bit, he bit a bat. Yeah. <laughs> I guess he didn't know it was a bad. Yeah, that's the funniest which part. It's terrifying. Is he's like, uh, he's like, I thought it was fake or something, and I was like, and, and, like, I was wondering if that's true like, or if that's on, like his cover. No, I think it was true. I'm just like Ozzy. How many, how many drugs were you on? Every drug, all drugs. He Maybe also he also snorted ants once. There's nothing on him. Dark stars are weird. Yeah, of course they're. I mean, they're basically rewarded for being weird. The weirder they are, the more they stand out. I was I was looking at a uh, the music video for Eat the Rich by Aerosmith recently, and just kind of 
getting reacquainted with what Aerosmith looks like because I'd kind of forgotten and like like Steven Tyler is such a fucking <laughs> he doesn't look real I don't, I, I, he, I don't I don't like Aerosmith at all Steven Tyler looks like the fucking like theme park uh, car caricature artists version of himself <laughs> Like well, the giant chinned, like exaggerated features artist version, but like that's just what he looks like. Well, the, the he's thing that's funny, he is looks that, so not real. I think real. he's always looked that way. I don't think yeah. it, I don't think it's like cosmetic surgery. I think he just looks that yeah, way. No. You look at his fucking daughter, and you're like, yeah, you look like that too. For de you can see you can see him back for decades, and he's always looked like something just is something that's so weird that he looks like a, a Snapchat filter that exaggerated his face <laughs> but that's just him all the time it's all stretched out <clears throat> it's like it's like for the B movies there's that one person that has a really huge head and a tiny face in the middle of their head <laughs> and he's like in a bunch of B movies and, it's, and he's got like a, a cartoonishly exaggerated chin that's like all are you talking about a real person huge yeah he's in like he's in like a ton of like B movies and stuff and it's like he doesn't look real how is he real <laughs> Drugs. I don't like that she's been <clears throat> taking drugs. I need to wink. He's just chugging hard liquor. Yep. He's trying to get through this. It's going. <clears throat> <clears throat> you. I can't believe you're still alive. Bradley. Let him live. Dad. <laughs> You. Oh. Happens anyway. Yeah. Ooh, this gets sad. And now, now it's even worse because I mean, not that it was. I mean, I think it was worse before, but it's fucked up because you. Yeah, it's not a choice. Mm. Yeah. Ready for more sad tin drum music. <laughs> <laughs> More happy syndrome music to I'm, accompany our sad yeah, thoughts. I'm the I'm the volcano, and I'm gonna blow. You just have you just have anger issues. Yeah. Yeah. See if you can kill him before. Yeah. No. He's he's he just gets before, triggered. Before uh, what's her face shows up, old buddy. He's having an episode because of some shit that has happened. Oh, it's gonna make you sad. do it anyway. Oh. Yeah. No, we get to we get, get to come and my, my daughter to death. <laughs> We're sitting in sad silence now. Yeah, I'm just thinking. Mm. <laughs> I understand, like, it's one of those situations. In his rage, he devoured several jerky to heal. <laughs> he's just stuffing his face with horse, horse jerky as he's angrily beating up a child. Yeah. It's always horse. Horses are, like, powerful in this universe or something. Well, I, I think the imp the idea is, like, you... No one really wants to eat horse jerky. It's It basically implies the apocalypse has happened. Like, you only see horse jerky in a situation like this. Because it's not the preferred animal meat. Like, it's when you're eating dog meat and Yeah, but out. specifically, all the strongest things are horse in this game. Including the fact that Brad's ability is had the entire game that recovers SP as horse stance. Well, that is a real stance. Yeah, but I mean, like, there's a clear, like, there's a clear ongoing thing where all the most powerful things are horse in this game. Well, they are strong. No. I've changed. Yeah, nothing plays out differently. I mean, at least we can say He's now that we angry. At least now we can say we tried. Yeah. Is the is the idea that in that in that flick of rage you just destroyed him? Oh yeah, no, he's gone. He was there before the rage, and now he's a smear. The words of Terry Hints fills your soul. <laughs> if you if you want, you can save to a different slot in case you fail. <laughs> oh. Okay. Thanks. Terry from Terry, Beyond the Grave. Still, still hinting at my bullshit. Oh, Terry. I miss Terry. Terry was. I think never he gonna... misses being alive. <laughs> I don't think Terry was ever going to be good, but I liked Terry. Maybe he'd get good eventually. I liked his leopard print. You just gotta grind top. all the way to level ninety nine, then he just becomes Goku. That would be great. But with, but he still gives tutorials, <laughs> which is more useful than what Goku does usually, which is like, kind of doom the world. Goku's honestly kind of a. Fuck up, like yeah. His, the, I was always weirded out because he always, like, I don't know how him and his wife had a kid, because <laughs> he always acts like he doesn't understand anything, like a child. 
Yeah. And I'm like, your poor wife, like... I mean, a, a lot of there's a lot of Japanese protagonists that are practically written as being just like straight up asexual, like they don't even understand the idea but, but, of sexuality. Poor Chi Chi, or, Ch or Chi think about it ever. Chi Chi's trying to have a normal life and like and probably, probably wants skip. to get laid. Then they'll just have time skips to have a family. All of a sudden, and and Goku's like, just like some really dumb little kid forever. And I'm like, I feel bad that she like has to deal with that. <laughs> Chi Chi. I mean, that, yeah. And then all the then of course all the taking your child away to go on suicide missions to save the world where, where people constantly die yeah and yeah she's just at home freaking out being married to someone like that'd be terrifying was it uh look at look at i just I didn't realize that he just drifts away <laughs> bye bye there's definitely some of that in the boys but a lot of it in invincible with the uh how uh, how fucking creepy it would be to be married to somebody that was like superhuman and could literally just like cr crush you on accident, like the, like how quickly the situations can turn, like how scary you actually would be, or you could be to these people who you love. The thought of like inadvertently hurting the people you love is like really scary, which is why what just happened in this game is very effective. Yeah. I guess there's both sides. There's like the accidental scary stuff, but also just like, I mean, but I mean, mainly mean from the perspective of being the spouse of, of, to the superhero character and how like threatening that could be. When you get up on this ledge on the far left, there was like a little bag. It was an item. It almost feels like Goku has to be a little idiot all the time because otherwise he'd be kind of terrifying. Rando rations. Well, it's like, it's like he doesn't. Yeah, it's like he, uh. He's like the most powerful being continuously over and over again. Aren't Vegeta and Bulma a thing? That, yeah, 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 Trunks. That I, actually did happen. I liked that what one. What a fucking nightmare. <laughs> you should not. <laughs> Vegeta's even worse. Like, that's such a horrible idea. No, but I, I think I like the personalities together. <laughs> yeah, but he's so fucking powerful that it's terrifying. I love Bulma. I don't even like I don't even yeah. like Dragon Ball Z, to be honest. I never yeah. liked that show, but like Trunks I fucking is my love character Bulma. In the entire thing. Like I, I, I watched history of Trunks more than any of the actual arcs of Dragon Ball Z. I watched I Dragon Ball better than Dragon Ball Z, but I always thought Bulma was a cutie. Isn't that based on Journey to the West? Very vaguely, like to me, very vaguely. Uh. Um. Hold it. <laughs> I'm not done yet. <laughs> Look at me, Bradley. I didn't think God cared about me. Hell, I used to clean toilets, but not in this world. Now I get the girl. <laughs> Finally, I get what I deserve. Ah? Don't touch her. What? Her face? Gotta brand her. That way everyone will know she's mine. What the fuck? Jeez. Oh, he's got like... Who is he? Mr. Anganelli. I don't think we've encountered him. He knows us. <laughs> yeah, he did. Yeah, he said... Who is he? But I don't know how well we know him from earlier. I'm hoping that I'm just really strong at this point compared to anyone I fight, because otherwise... Because you don't got nothing else if going I get for in you. Yeah, if I get in trouble, I'm not <laughs> sure how much strategy I'll be able to, like, Ew. use. He licked to heal himself. I'm in a horse stance. Show domination. Wow, that gives me more SP than I even have. Ow. Fuck, that hurt. Why does he have fucking... X-Men claws? Yeah, uh... Or like Vega. Yeah. I don't think they're like... real. They're, he's just got some claws. That's no, so why, yeah, I think he it's went, more like... It's more like Vega where there's gloves. He just found some shit. To wear the creepy boy. Uh, at first, I thought, he, I thought he was me. grating her face with a cheese grater at first. Yeah, no, he's just he's just cutting up her face. Fucking stop! What's with the weird Valdo stance? He also has a horse stance. He's kind of like Valdo, actually. He's got the claws too. Yeah. Every time he uses horse stance, he gets stronger. 
Well, now pacing is stupid licking. I guess if he keeps licking, then that avoids a lot of the other bad things that can happen to me. Yeah. So fuck it, keep licking me, jackass. Her face! <laughs> My mark on history! <laughs> 69 XP. <laughs> 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 oh, poor buddy. Buddy. Here, cover up. Brad gave Buddy his poncho. I don't want I this. I don't want... Oh. But your heart. Your face. And... Your chest. Is it okay? It's fine. I'm not a princess. I don't want your help. Why can't you leave me alone? What? What do you want from me? You've done nothing but hurt me. No, I want to help you. Rick, Sicky. That's not what they say. They don't know me, buddy. Nobody does. I do, Brad. I know what you really are. You're a monster. You've taken everything away from me. And Marty. What you did to him. Only a monster could do that. Buddy, you don't know him. I know he was a better father to me in a few days than you ever were. Mm. Brad's body is feeling strange. He has become a failure. Oh. What is... Oh! oh. His, stat, his status is failure. <laughs> Mystery jerky, save me. <sighs> oh. And now you don't even have a poncho. No. Yep, nope. I'm just wearing sunscreen and a locket. Oh, I... your head has sunscreen on it. Yeah. At least there's that. Uh... This is the most kicked protagonist ever. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> oh, we have a bike to help you. Mandatory falling. Rando! I have some of your rations, you Rando. Fuck. If only you were rational. Locked. Wait, do you need, um, is that little machine down there give you oil? Or that one? Yeah. You have that? all those bottles. Let me have it. It looks like something you should be able to grab. Oh, there was, a, there was a little bag at the bottom, too. I'm gonna be a scary boy. You're already a scary boy. In terms of emotional stability. <laughs> so slow all the time. What, do all, what, what are we gonna do with all this dead air, Stephanie? <laughs> well, especially because we're all somber now, too. Yeah, it's like, this, hey, here we go. Well, it's, it's supposed to make, like, obviously, like, uh, I like when games do this on purpose because they want you to, like, think about your actions. Here's some quiet time while you travel to the end. That's why I always like Shadow of the Colossus Was for there that. another machine back here anywhere? Yeah. I forget one. There it is. That's a lot of fire bombs. Uh, I feel like something might be happening. I, uh, because they gave me a lot of bottles on that one island. A lot, yeah. Yeah, I have eight diesel fire bombs. And a partridge in a pear tree. <laughs> That's all I want for Christmas, is eight diesel fire bombs. <laughs> and, and like, one nipple. <laughs> Collector's item. I mean, I could be like Ed Gein and make a belt out of them. You need more than one, though. Yeah, I think nipples aren't the most efficient <laughs> way of getting anything done. Honestly, the ability to make a belt out of nipples means you've... That's a lot of nipples. Yep. That's a collection. <laughs> a belt of nipples. I like guess a measuring unit. Yep. <clears throat> a murder of crows. A belt of nipples. You know, they were auctioning off, like, a cauldron that was at his house. And I would have loved- he has a fucking cauldron. Like, basically like a big pot. And you know that it was used for some shit. I would have loved to buy that. But Doesn't it was very expensive. To talk to me? No, I don't think there's anyone in there. 
I mean, they're locked. Everything's locked. I'm assuming from the outside. Pay attention to me. Pay attention to me. Buy me more jewelry. Buy me jewelry. Oh. You can't go back? <laughs> there we go. Oh, that was kind of rude. It's like, hey. Yeah. <laughs> Just seeing him slap into the wall. Oh, wait. That's where you came from? That's the diesel thing I already got, huh? Oh, yeah. Then I guess, I guess we're good. Gonna, yeah, I recognize the little disc. Okay, I guess we're fine. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was going to say, that was that was rude of the game. So I wanted to go the other way. Well, if you didn't save, you'd be fucked. No. <laughs> End of the line, friend. She belongs to Rando now. The school guy. Jesus, do I have to fight 30 people in a row? <laughs> hey. What happened to her face? It's ruined. The bald guy did it. That's Buddy. You. <laughs> it doesn't look like me, though, so it's weird. Yeah, but I wouldn't be saying my own name, I think. Yeah. You need to run now. Buddy. Stop. Who's that? It's my party. They also think I'm a monster and they're going to fight me now. You came. You can't run from us. The girl is ours. I never liked you anyway. We have to protect our futures, and after this, our children's futures. It never should be about one man. His people come first. That This is the lesson you need to be taught. I barely know you. I barely know you, and maybe this isn't my place to speak, but this is humanity's last hope, brother. We gotta do what we gotta do. Sorry, friend. No. Every single one of them have a unique dialogue based on who you brought here. Well, yeah, because the last guy said he barely knows us. Yeah. And it's true. You can't have her. All of you people are filling her head with nonsense. Blinding her. You don't understand. I have to save her. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, you have to fight your fucking... Uh, well, you, just bought them, you just bought them equipment to kick yeah. your ass with. Damn it. Whoa, I got super attacks. Burning head slide. Damn. Body. But the other two are prone. I got a bunch of fucking super attacks now. I'm very angry. Oh, this oh, my class changed to failure. These are the failures attacks. Apparently. Well, I guess the failure has nothing to lose, so... But guys, I never took the drug. That means I'm the good guy. This isn't fair. <laughs> oh, they can't get back up. The you know, prone attack is so strong. You know, earlier I was talking about, like, oh, I really miss... I miss Terry. I would have been so sad to fight Terry. Yeah. So I'm thankful he's not here because I don't want to think. We would have killed the shit out of Terry at this point. I wouldn't have wanted to think of Terry as being someone who wanted to fuck a little kid. <laughs> that would have made me sad. And also Farty too. Farty and Terry are my two favorites. I mean, the better characters are waiting for the later. <laughs> they're waiting for later. Well, because they're talking about the future of humanity in some cases, because there's the only there's only one woman left. But yeah. It isn't how genes work. They're pretty fucked at this point, anyway. Yeah, and then also like, okay, so just you know, obviously taking the taking the little grossness out of this, this 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 person, this girl could probably have thirty kids at most. Like you're like, I, th I think their record, I think their record's like forty five. But but the woman I'm thinking of who had forty five had a handful of twins and triplets and things. Yeah. So she kind of got to cheat because she just was genetically really prone to having multiple kids at once. Like Octomom. I mean, Octomom was, she had a artificial insemination and that, so there's, there's a reason she had eight kids. It was a, it was like, when you're doing that, they put in extras in, in case you lose some, because you most likely do. But in her case, she didn't lose any, which is why she had all eight kids. Damn. <clears throat> they expect you to maybe end up with like a, a two or something, I think. Rando, 
But... Face. Sir, you don't have to speak. D don't worry, little girl. A face is nothing. The inside, it's what matters. No. I... I... I know you are strong. Rando. Smoke. That's the first time I've ever heard him. Boy sounds so weak. I can't believe it. Wait, what about the bald guy? We haven't forgotten. Face it, you can't win. Just give up now and walk away with your life. You don't need to die today. No. Hmm? You don't understand. I've been dead for 35 years. He was a ghost the whole time. <laughs> Today is the day I live. <laughs> That's the rage screen. Oh my god, I'm actually going to fight everybody. Okay. You're going to try to fight everybody. I don't think you can win this. Or it's like a rage session where he just fucking destroys everybody with his like superpowers of rage. I think you're going to... I think... I think... Like, it's such a huge mob of unique enemies that it, it's like... It's like his, it's Rando's version of like how I have a party. I can't horse stance. No, you're a failure now. I'm a lot of fip. There's <laughs> yep. So I think, I think what's Diesel gonna, bombs. I think what's gonna happen is you're gonna keep fighting mobs of enemies. You're gonna use all your fire bombs. I think they, I think the creator of this game made so many enemies that you'll never get through it. And I don't you'll, know. you'll die here. Fire bombs are really effective. Yeah, but you, you, you like this guy who made the, or this person, I don't know who it is, made this game, made so many characters. <laughs> Birdman, stop living. Oh fuck, you can out heal my, my, my shit. Fuck you. You wasted a firebomb on one guy. <laughs> well, I, all I could do is bite him and he was out healing my bites. <laughs> this guy's stronger than I thought. He can't possibly take out down all of, take down all of us. <laughs> you're, Kill him. You're a random Russian guy. <laughs> I like this one in the middle doing like weird stance with his belly hey. out. You think you can beat this? Um, that guy sucked. <laughs> you got fucking no mask over here. You got. Ow. Skull boy. I like Skull boy. Quack. Doc sound thwack is funny to me. It is a good one. It is. A, I feel like it's pretty accurate. Bo. I like looking at uh, the noises that animals make in different countries, like the onomatopoeias yeah. for other animals. Ghetto, ghetto. Yeah, the the frog one's the, like one of the best ones. I was looking at that the other day. One of them was just like grr, and I was like, I don't know about yeah. that grr. <laughs> or like the countries where dogs barking is wow. <laughs> like or like W A O. Wow. I mean, that, that's honestly not yeah. wrong. What the hell? He's not human. He's got like 20 fire bombs. And also... How is he still alive? No arms. How is he throwing them? <laughs> Where is he? Like, even if he can throw really well with his mouth, how is he getting all of them so easily to throw again? He's got a gun. I'm in trouble, actually. I'm telling I don't think yeah. you can win this, dude. As much as I believe in you, like... Horse jerky. That jerky jerky. He's scared. He should be scared. They're trying to give you some, like, Dean They're... Fritz Clark is thinking. Mm -hmm. Nothing scarier than somebody who just swallows an entire horse jerky in the middle of a fight. <laughs> and then throws a firebomb with no yeah. <laughs> The, um... The... <gasps> I have horse stance and horse jerky. Every time I use horse jerky, I'm just taking a bite out of myself. That's why they're scared. <laughs> it's actually made from my arms. Yep, I kept them. What are you thinking about, dude? He's thinking about how he's dead. <laughs> yep. Just, just give him the girl. Yeah, let's go. He's a fucking monster. Get away, you freak. Nope, more fight. Diesel bombs. I wonder why they gave me so many diesel bombs. Yeah, I was, you know, I was, I was like, <laughs> hmm. At this point, Brad is not effective at almost anything. He has the really cool slide, but if you ran out of SP, fuck you. <laughs> like, you, you care to don't do things anymore. Some of these people, I wonder... I don't recognize all... Like, some of these people, I wonder how many we've encountered. 
Big Ant. Big Ant's crying. No. Gone Duggan. I don't remember. I don't. I don't remember guy. any of these. I thought but I remember the skull guy. We've seen Spike but... card before. Yeah, but I don't know if he's a generic yeah. guy. I don't remember. I don't remember the dwarf guy at all. I think. Uh, How did he even die? He's burning. Remember? Oh right. Help me, Lisa. Cry out for relief. It hurts. You have to scream. What do those do for you? Help me, help me, Lisa. Like once, who's Lisa? This wasn't here. Lisa's, I think, is his sister. Sister. Yeah. Cry out for relief. Why do you think it's his sister? Because everyone, because people just said it's his sister, sister. I don't know if it's spoilers. Or... <laughs> I think that's just what the last game is about. So I don't think it's necessarily spoilers or what. I can't tell anymore what spoilers are. I think you play as Lisa and Lisa the first. They have the same dad. Little spider fuck. Which maybe like if you if you had played would add more spite to Yeah. To how you feel about him in this game. God! Oh my god. That's me. I was wrong. I think my eye is out. I think you have an arrow in your head. Wow. Everyone is mulch. Buddy, stay back. Don't touch her. Master Armstrong, please. We don't need to f fight. Oh. She is the future. Do we know him? Well, he's rando, isn't he? Yeah, but do you remember? Wasn't was there a stuttering character in the flashbacks? Wasn't there a little kid that was stuttering that we saved really early on from a fight? Maybe. He's just a kid. This game had seven hundred characters. Yeah, it's, it is hard to keep him straight. Uh, oh he's, fuck! He's a oh come no! Come at me, scrub lord! I'm ripped. Oh no, he's hot. <laughs> oh no. Do I have SP again? He called you Master Armstrong. Remember, you, you used to teach karate. Yeah. I think he's a kid that we encountered early on that we was getting bullied or so something. Oh, it might be the kid that we yeah, trained that, in the flashback. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. The one that just watched it first. Please burn and trip. Ow. Scream. <laughs> How did it fail? We just screamed. Yeah. You can't fail at screaming. I yeah. guess you can, but... You just didn't get it out. It wasn't cathartic enough. Boop. It's done. Burning and stunned. Whoa! Boy's dangerous. Isaac's doing shit again. Oop. They have a lot of healing items. I have collected many a rando ration. It does feel like this is kind of a fuck it, just go ahead and win scenario. Like, t to you or to him? To me. Like, you think there's, a, like, a way to just fucking win? Well, the, the whole game, ever since I've been alone, I don't think that's, it's ever supposed to be challenging anymore. Yeah, you, like, you powered up. Just just out of your sheer misery, and you're you're hitting the bottom, like, you have nothing to fear anymore. Well, they've, they've removed all your options, so you, the game would be, like, unplayable in many cases if it was particularly hard. Yeah, and yeah. I, and I am that case, because I am maximum limbs removed with no joy addiction, so I also, or I'm addicted but not re relieving the addiction, addiction by using it, so I'm constantly being kicked by that. Yeah. And just, everything sucks. Ouchies. Oh, it's another one of those situations where it's like, like once they run, like bring up Braid again, but it's one of those situations yeah. where the people that you're trying to save like have agency and yeah, you need that, to remember that's, that's that. That's what I was thinking about when she said, I'm not a princess. Well, it's like, it's like her, 
like on on paper, like the story of like people trying to go save this girl, even without even without the creepy context. Like that is a that is like a fairy tale type story, but things just don't work out for people, and things aren't like rainbows, and the people you're trying to save don't always want you to save them. Yeah. Like that, like it, that's it, what the book Paper Towns is about. Yeah. I I remember you telling me about that one. I'm trying to think there's other there's other ones like that too, and I'm trying to think about them. Where it's like like oh, like I never liked you. Like that, yeah. that kind of like uh, you think of me in the in this like this like evangelized beautiful way, but like I'd never have thought of you a single time. <laughs> He's cracking. I was running out of items, so I started to think this might be a, a fight a where you actually fucked. <laughs> But uh, his face cracked. There's signs. It, it makes me a oh. bit a bit sad because I like this guy. Yeah. <laughs> I think he's the one who's gonna be the nicest to her, and I don't think it's us who's gonna be the nicest to her. Well, you you definitely turn on Brad in the father killing scene. Well, I I, I it's mean, kind of hard to come back from that one. Honestly, even even like at the beginning with her wanting to go out and do stuff and you telling her no, like her yeah. crying in the basement, like it was like it was sad, but you could you could see his point of view of the idea that like uh, fuck everyone on the planet's gonna be after her. This is a problem. And and, and you think and you think like oh well she might not understand the it's like like the severity of, of that, but. As soon as she tells you the first time that she doesn't want you to, and you keep doing it, that that's when he lost like my my vote because she obviously has awareness and made a choice, yeah. and you're not respecting that as much as like her life's gonna be awful, like her life's not gonna be any better with you. Oop, am I burning now? That's really bad. I don't like I don't like burning. Have you seen Children of Men? No, but we watched that. We watched that really great long. Yeah, Uncut. it's a good companion piece to watch for this because the, it's the same thing where it's like there's one woman that's pregnant after everyone no one's been pregnant for 10 years or something yeah frankly like when presented with any kind of post-apocalyptic movie my that's my first thought like is as fucked up as that is that i have to think about things like that i always think about things like that or even honestly even just being like i don't know being like, being like, like, like the idea of a pirate doesn't really work for for women. Like, <laughs> any situation where you're with a bunch of men for an extended period of time with no other options, like it gets to be, like, it's just, yeah, I don't know. I'm not saying like all guys are like that or anything. Like, there's obviously. It's, it's not the best dice to roll. I've, I've walked, I've walked downtown at night through the tenderloin too many times now. <laughs> Oh, that, that was the place where you, that one time you tricked somebody into walking with you and your friend just so there was a dude with you. Yeah. And then you're like, yeah, I'm not actually interested. We just wanted to, we just wanted someone to walk us through the tenderloin. Yeah, I got, I got stuck in the tenderloin after going to see an AJJ concert. Uh, oh. What's, you know, I don't wonder how I got my scars. I think he's cute. What does he look like? He's like a ghoul. Yeah, it looks like it, it's like familiar in some way, but I don't know what. Like uh, like something specific. I mean, oh, so that, that's why he was like, it, what matters is what's on the inside. Like he understands. Yeah. But you know, I was stuck down. I was stuck downtown in the Tenderloin after an AJJ concert because I didn't realize that the public transit system that I was using he's crying. closed really early. Uh, he's called Broken Man now. Well, you humiliated him. And so I had to convince some guy who was trying to hit on us to walk with us to a bar because I needed... I was like... I was like... I'm, I'm sorry that the world is like this, but you're gonna walk us to a bar, I'm gonna buy you any drinks that you want, I just need to walk with you because you're a man, and as stupid as that is, it's gonna help me get to the place I need to be, because my friend was completely wasted, not gonna be any help at all. So I, I, I used a stranger to help walk me to a bar so I can sit and wait for a ride. You depend on the kindness of strangers. Yes. Yeah. Because he didn't realize we were in a sketchy part of town because he was from far away. 
And I was like, yeah, okay, so here's the deal. You're in a really bad part of town. You're not gonna talk to anyone. You're gonna keep walking. Like, don't interact with all these people because people kept trying to hassle us. You're gonna keep walking. You're gonna walk us to a bar. We're gonna sit. I'm gonna buy you all the drinks that you want. We're gonna talk. We're gonna have a nice time. And you're, we're gonna wait so I can get a ride. And we can take you, we can ride, like, give you a ride back to your hotel. Like, I'm sorry the world is like this. I appreciate your help. <laughs> I'm sorry the world is like this. He's like, we're, a very long fight. we're in a scary part of town? And I was oh like, I was like, yes, you are. You're in a really, you're in a bad part of town. Was he from the concert? Yeah, he's from the concert. In fact, his date got roofied at that concert. Oh. But the reason she got, she was underage and she was asking people to buy her liquor. So she, she ditched him. She ditched him because he wouldn't buy her liquor. And she just, she ended up getting roofied. You really are the best. Thank you for everything. It totally is that guy. Yeah, that makes me really, that makes me especially sad. I've about killed this. everyone that I ever knew. I wonder if you would have to gotten. chase after someone who doesn't want me. He's done. Look at that death pose. It's very, it's kind of a, it's kind of a peaceful, like, a resignation type of death pose. I think there's a knife in his ass. I think so too. Oh, poor buddy. Buddy. Oh. Don't worry, buddy. I'm the good guy. <laughs> Don't you believe me? It's over. Why are you doing this to me? Why are you trying now? Why weren't you there when I needed you? You've taken everything away from me. I know. I finally had a chance at life and you you take it away. Stop. Why are you trying to hurt me so much? You make me sick. Stop. I hate you. I know you hate me. I know. Why, Brad? Why did you do this to me? I had a chance to choose something for myself. No, buddy. You didn't. For good or for evil, it doesn't matter. Those men wanted to use you. People are always going to try and use you and hurt you. Choose your life for you. Don't preach to me. Please. It's too late for that. You can't you can't just be a father all of a sudden. I just For once, I wanted to do something good. I'm the one that was supposed to protect you. I can't let anyone hurt you. Brad. You've hurt me the most. Crying. Buddy. Can you do something for me? Please. What? Hold me. Why? I want to know what it's like. I'm begging you. It's my- it's- it's her choice. Oh, no. Ah. Hug? Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Buddy. Yes. Did I do the right thing? <laughs> what a username. <laughs> Lisa, 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 Lisa. I lowered my Wally. That's a lot of music samples, isn't it? Yeah. Fairy Terry. Kill her. Love. Wow. Okay. They said kill her and they said Brad Armstrong. Yeah. Haste her. It's your fault. 
Oh boy, credits. Modern algebra. Burn, Burn. Kickstarter backers. Burn Kickstarter backers. Love. Wake up, buddy, buddy, buddy. Ah, uh, he's a joy monster or something. But, uh. Uh. Why did we. He moves. <laughs> uh, he moves. Why? Oh no, he moves. Why did this happen to us? Yeah, I thought you got this away from using joy. That's what I thought too. I mean, we did use joy in the past. Yeah. Is this the fate of everyone who uses joy even if you stop? Maybe. I mean, that means Buddy's fucked though, too. Hmm. Game's less over than we thought. Hey, it's Flowey. Flowey? I always said Flowey. It's like flower. Yeah, flower. I always think it's funny when, like, this dark shit's happening. I look over and I see Kiki sleeping on the bed. Oh, is it her? I don't know. Maybe. She's bandaged up. No? Lisa. Uh-oh. Well, it's a failure. The joy has no use to our investors. They said it can't be used as a weapon. Once it's gone into effect, the user begins to lose control. They no longer can make choices for themselves. Only the user's innermost desires come out. The only plus is that it doesn't take a lot of joy in order to start the transformation. But still, they say it has no military benefits. I guess that means... Enough. I've known this from the start, you fool. What? They've served their purpose. We got their money, and now they're gone. And now it's time for me to build my world. Yado, you're acting insane. This whole thing has fallen apart. You've lost it all. It's time to let this go. Shut up. If you feel that way, then why don't you leave? Exactly. We both have our reasons for staying. Besides, I have a plan. And what's that? Nancy. I'll use her. Jesus Christ, Yado. That's your daughter. And furthermore, you can't go you can't possibly expect that to work. It won't be that simple. You're fucking insane. Bernard, Bernard, Bernard. Once you taste a power like this, you will understand me. Yado, the last fucking time. My name is not Bernard. It's Buzzo. What is that? Is that, a, is that a revelation means something? Yeah, what the fuck? There's too many names to keep track what of. Are we supposed to keep track? Like, I, I don't remember these yeah. people. Uh, I think we found the, the Joy Labs, and there was, like, specific, like, bosses and things that were named things and notes by from people. Mm -hmm. So I think Yado was the guy that kind of brought Joy to everything. So he probably doomed the world? But, uh, yeah, that happened. Well, he's talking about... I think the ending there was us finding uh, Buddy, but hallucinating she was Lisa and attacking her. And I think the next game, or the DLC for this, Lisa the Joyful, I think you play as uh, Buddy. And so I think, like, going how, how this game ended, you might start that game fighting the uh, Joy Monster Brad. That depends, of course, on whether or not it's a sequel or if it's just Lisa's adventures in parallel to this one. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know the story of that game, but I think you play as Buddy. I just at least on accident. Maybe the implication of this. What what happened to? What happened to all the women again? I don't remember. I remember uh, the guy I voiced is Mitch Hedberg. <laughs> Very early on, explaining that his his wife was gone, but I don't think he. I don't know if they talked about the, the women just disappear. Yeah, I don't remember if they just skipped over explaining it or not. Hmm. I mean, they were talking about Joy, about it being a military weapon, which means that it's probably happened before the world ended. Yeah. And, and, the, and also because this guy has a daughter, which means that it was, like, in the past. But... I'm, I'm wondering if he did make the world end by somehow... ruining all the women. <laughs> I 
I wonder if Yeah, the, the brief summary is just that she's trying to he's trying to save his adopted daughter, which is the last female in Olathe after being kidnapped. In the pervert infested apocalypse. That's why it's just like, all right, that's a way to summarize things. Yeah, Lisa was Brad's younger sister. She was abused by their father, Buzzo. One of the major Oh shit. Oh, is, I remember Buzzo. Buzzo's, Buzzo's the worst guy. Buzzo's the guy that was doing all the shit cutting our limbs off and everything. Buzzo's the guy that cut Buddy's nipple off. Yeah, yeah. Buzzo was that piece of shit, which we never saw again for a while. So that's why, that's the reveal of Buzzo. So that I was voicing Buzzo, who was telling Yado to stop. Huh. His motives are unknown. Other than that, he's a joyful boy. <laughs> yeah, he is a joyful boy. And Rando just kind of shows up. He never did anything wrong necessarily, did he? No. In fact, he gave me those rations and left, and it was his people that decided to attack me. Yeah, no, he's oddly sensitive and calm. It was his description. No, Rando. I wonder I wonder if uh oh, there's the person. I don't hmm. know. We missed so many characters. We did. There was multiple parts where we lost literally an entire like town because of a choice we made, and then we just like, well. Like the uh, I think at one point they were like, if you like there was like a consequence for fucking with Buzzo, I think at one point might have been that they took out an entire town, and then at one point we gave the two best friends uh, f like a firebomb, and they took out <laughs> they took out yeah, like the did. entire like dojo town that had several characters, including like a guy that's a like, tiger. <laughs> like we missed out on having a tiger friend. Oh, that yeah, that is a bummer. There's just so many characters we missed out on. It's like, well. There's um this uh th this game sure has variants in from playthrough to playthrough even if it's not necessarily like the most major 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 spots or something. The story is based loosely on the t 1992 novel The Children of Men. Oh yeah. <laughs> there we go. There it goes. I have no idea how similar the movie and book are, but yeah, that's uh I was right to bring that up. We're just looking at the wiki for context, but uh yeah, that was Lisa. We did it. We did <laughs> we it. We made it. A scarf right. forever. We were, we were closer to finishing than I thought we were. Uh, yeah, that was a nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> and if we want to, we can look into Lisa the First, Lisa the Joyful, and then also the fan stuff. Uh, we'll have to just make up our minds whether we want to do that or another game first, because it's a big choice each time. <laughs> yeah. the um, I enjoyed that game. <laughs> yeah. I did. I mean, I... Uh, obviously, like, the, the heavy content is there but i i enjoy that I, I enjoy that more than i enjoy things that have no consequence um i'm actually really off put by things that don't have like stakes or yeah. things that don't have like i think i think there's, there's like a lot of potential for like cathartic meaning in, in this and i'll definitely be thinking about it for a while i uh or brad <laughs> i do feel bad for him it's really bad we, we we did our best, but that wasn't what we should have done. Yeah. I do wonder if you could have let yourself get killed. And if that would have been... Yeah, literally every time you die. You yeah. Could, you uh, could just stop playing. That is true. Yeah, I guess those are the only options. To stop playing or yeah. keep playing. But to finish the game and, and to play is the nicest thing you could do for Buddy. Probably. Yeah, Lisa, uh, Buddy essentially, essentially spends the whole game telling you not to play the game. Yeah. <laughs> just stop. But you couldn't stop, could you? I'm Sans. <laughs> well, we had, we had like a weird emotional attachment to this, and I think at the end, like asking her to hold us is really telling, because we have a lot of hangups that we put on Buddy. That's just a brutal ending for the character. Like, did I do the right thing? And then he just falls over dead. You're like, yeah. Ugh. All right. Ugh. What a thing to think right before you die. <laughs> yeah. See you guys next time. <laughs> Goodbye, guys. Heavy stuff. We all die alone. Oh no. Mm -hmm.